guys, welcome back. So today I will be sharing with you how I put together Liam's alfalfa costume and also I DIY'd the bow tie, so I will be showing you how I did that as well. So for this costume, I'm using all materials and clothing that I already have. If you need to make a bow tie, use a shirt or tank top you don't care for to use as material. A button down shirt, it doesn't matter the color. Uh, suspenders, I got these off another pair of jeans. Sharp scissors, hot glue gun, alligator clip, but I ended up not using it for, to fasten the bow tie. Uh, khaki pants, shoes, and of course you need baby hair gel. So you're going to need to cut out three pieces of fabric, two on the thicker side, one about half the size of one of them. I honestly eyeballed it, but if you are the type of person that needs measurements, I got these measurements off of another DIY for bow ties on YouTube. Two thicker ones would probably be around four and a half by eight inches, and the thinner one would be about over a little over one and a half, almost two inches by six inches. And then you're just going to glue and fold the sides of the thicker pieces towards the center. And it doesn't have to look perfect, you can always trim it to make it fit better. And then you will be doing the same thing for the other thicker piece of material. Just hot glue and fold the sides to the center. Then after both of the thicker materials have been folded over and glued, I put them on top of each other and I trim off the sides to make them even. So uh, basically what you're going to do, you're just going to cinch the two pieces of material together, the thicker pieces, kind of in the shape of a bow tie. And from the back of it, you're going to put a little uh, drop of hot glue and onto the thin piece. And then you're just gonna wrap it around once so that it tightens the bow and it just gives it a more defined bow tie look. It, the camera actually gets cut off here because I didn't realize Liam moved my tripod, but when you see the finished product, you'll see what I mean. Sorry about the bad angle, guys, but that's the finished product of the bow. And to fasten the bow tie, like I mentioned before, I ended up not using the alligator clip. What I did was I just put a drop of hot glue straight onto his button, the very top one, and I just stuck it, the bow tie, on there. And it stayed and actually doesn't mess up the shirt. The hot glue is actually, when it's on plastic, it peels off very easily. So now I'm just parting Liam's hair down the middle. Alfalfa has a very, yeah, that part down the middle. Uh, I feel like that is definitely a big part of the look. And then of course the straight up spike in the back. Can't forget that. And just in case anyone was wondering, I'm using California Baby Jelly Mousse, the lavender one. It smells great and it has no harsh chemicals and it has a really great hold. I love this mousse. Liam's Aunt Kim and Uncle John got him this mousse, so thank you again guys. We love it. Also, I recommend definitely gelling and spiking up the hair after you put the clothes on. Also, alfalfa has freckles, so I'm just taking my brown eyeliner and I'm just gently dotting it on his cheeks and his nose. And that's the finished look. That's our alfalfa look. And all 
Also guys, this video was a collab with my cousin Len. She dressed her daughter Lena up as Darla and she is just the cutest Darla. If you would like to see how she put this look together, please check out her channel, Mommy NYC, and don't forget to like and subscribe. And also, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video of how I dress Liam up as Alfalfa, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to see more videos.